what's going on adventurers hey everybody we are currently in a very interesting place if you look behind us i don't know if you can see it uh, on the screen there but this is a cemetery in the middle of the woods and we've driven past it a couple times and we've never actually had the chance to go check it out so today for the first time we're going to give you an up close look at it we're going to pull out the necrophonic and see if anybody wants to talk to us today so let's go guys ow thorns thorns bad thorns this is really deep is it yeah there's beer bottles back here that's not good Watch for snakes too. Yeah. There's beer bottles back here. Yeah. That's not good. Whoa. Too much. Here. All right, guys, so you can see the cemetery is right behind us. We're going to be respectful. There's a gate there and it's currently closed, so we're going to stay over here. We're going to go ahead and get out the necrophonic now and see if anyone wants to talk to us. Hello? We're here to visit you. If any spirits want to come through and say hello. Yep. This is a, looks like a pretty old cemetery. Hello? Maybe a private, I don't know if it's a family cemetery or... It's kind of creepy. <laughs> is this a family, is this a family cemetery? Do you like visitors? Yes. Yeah. Anybody want to say their name? What's your name? Trina? really cold out here all of a sudden yeah all of a sudden the wind picked up are you all are there good spirits here is it safe here a different, a different vibe here yeah are you from this area are you from Maryland Mike? Did you hear Mike? Mm -hmm. Were any of you soldiers? Were you in this? Was anybody in the Civil War? Do you, any of you have family nearby? Is this a family grave? Hello. Hello. Hi. Hey, that's from far away. It almost sounded like Mrs. Delphire, mm -hmm. <laughs> to be honest. Did you make it cold? Are you making it colder? Goodness. Is there anything you want to say to us? Watch out. I see you have some bird feeders here. Do you like the bird feeders? What's your favorite bird that comes to visit you? Do you have family that comes and visits you? How old were you? What is, your, what is your name? Rick. Rick? Say Rick. Wow, we're getting a lot oh. of crazy answers here, guys. <laughs> how many, how many spirits are here right now?
Do you see a lot of deer? Do you see a lot of deer? Do you guys, do you know anything about the coronavirus? Yeah. Is there going to be a, is it going to be over soon? What month will it stop? What month will the coronavirus go away? Do you know? Weird. Is it will it go away this spring? Will it be gone in April? That's crazy. So I'm Jen and this is Lisa. Did you guys want to say our names? Okay, seriously. My hand, this right hand, I'm getting like a weird tingling sensation, like... Like something, is somebody touching like, Lisa? Like it's going through my hand. Is somebody touching Lisa right now? It was in my pocket. Yeah. Who's touching me? Can you touch her butt for me real quick? <laughs> hey! <laughs> You guys like visitors? <laughs> Do you like to touch people? Okay, that's kind of creepy. We only want to talk to deal with good spirits. Everybody else needs to just not be here. <laughs> yeah, we are protected. We're protected. By the power of God. Yeah, I have my necklace on. I do not. <laughs> Let's just rub that a little bit. <laughs> See that? This is protective. <laughs> the, wind, the wind died down when I pulled this out. Did you say oh. urgent or have mercy? It's weird I pulled this out. It changed. One book. Is that her dad too? Did you hear that? Yeah. Hello. Hello. This changed getting some nice people. <laughs> Who's talking to us now? Hello. Did you hear something up there? Yes. Yeah. Yes. They said yes. Are there people here? <laughs> Who are we talking to? Prison. What is your name? Earl. Are you ha are you in are you in heaven? Hello. How many spirits are here talking to us right now? How many of you are here? Do you like us? Do you like us visiting you? If you like us visiting you, can you say your name? I just heard a gunshot. I did too. Yes. I'm okay, we gotta go. Okay, we gotta go, guys. It feels like some hunters are in the area. We're hearing gunshots. Okay, we're gonna close this out. Thank you for speaking with us. And we ask you to stay here. We're protected. Do not follow us home. We're going to... Maybe we'll come back and visit another time. Thank you. Do you want us to come back and see you again? I think he said God. He did say God. All right, guys. We got to roll. We heard some gunshots in the area. And it probably is some hunters. So we got to get out of here. We'll see you on our next Raptor Adventure. Seriously, check this out. Oh, they turn it back on. There it goes again. That's I, insane. I turned it off and it came All right, out. let's just go. I don't care. We'll worry about it later.
<laughs> step high, step with your pole. <laughs> Marching through the woods. I think I'm safe. Okay, watch your head. All right. Oh shit, sorry. Leave, All right guys, we are about to get up out of here. <laughs> It feels good to be back in the car. That was a really creepy vibe in that cemetery. I'm not really sure what was going on. Lisa was feeling it too. Yeah. And I am not even playing, guys. The temperature literally dropped probably 20 degrees from the time we got there. Don't you agree? Yeah, and then the wind kicked up. And then when I pulled out my necklace, the protective, um, what's this called? Um, Selenite. So when we were at the um, cemetery, like Jen said, it got really cold, and then I pulled this out. I had it on, but it was underneath my sweatshirt, and when I actually pulled it out to the daylight, things seemed to calm down, didn't they? Like Yeah, definitely. You know, the tension of the spiritual part. 100%, I know yeah, what you're talking about. Interesting. It was and crazy. right before that, I was feeling that tingling in my hand, and then it went away. So did it feel like something was touching you? It felt like, uh, almost like a current going through it. That's what it feels like when I use the dowsing rods. Yeah, correct. That's exactly what it feels like. And it, I've never it doesn't done hurt. That. No. It's just kind of like a slight tingle. Like when your feet start to fall asleep. Like if your foot ever yes. falls asleep. Like when it's starting to. Not when it's numb. No. But like right when it's starting to fall asleep and you're like, oh, I better get up and walk yeah. around. It's the same feeling. And then it went away. So that was pretty insane, guys. Um, and I think it's a private cemetery. Like the gate was locked and stuff. So, um, you know, we just didn't feel right about trying to get into the gate yeah. so um I don't think that's a good idea. I think it was fine I mean they can still talk to us they could have still talked to us probably from the car <laughs> yeah. but we wanted to give you a little bit of a closer look and like I said it's the first time we've ever been there too so um I don't know it was a cool experience I don't know I don't know that we'll come back to this place because yeah. the deer maybe oh wow deer. guys look as we were talking about this place the deer started running oh they have some weight huge weight look how long they are too those tails wow Deer are very spiritual animals, guys. And we often see them where we go, our travels. We were meant to see those deer, guys. Yeah. They they came out literally as we were leaving. And had we been five minutes earlier or five minutes later, we would have missed them. So that was cool, and definitely it was meant to be. You know how they say sometimes you just know that you're in the right place at the right time? That was one of those instances. Yeah, they're gone. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna turn on the dousing rods. We are in another location currently. Um, this whole area where we are is known for um, the Civil War. There were Civil War soldiers that died all through here. Um, we're really close to Gettysburg, probably only about 15 minutes from here is Gettysburg. But, you know, I mean, for miles and miles was the Civil War. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the dousing rods. I don't know how well you'll be able to see them right now. It's starting to get a little bit darker going to ask a couple questions and then we'll decide if we want to come back here to further investigate with the uh, macrophonic or the SB7. So let's turn them on here. Give me my yes answer. All right, there we go. Thank you. Recalibrate, please. Are there any spirits here with us from the Civil War? Any spirits from the Civil War era that want to communicate with us? Oh, there we go. All right, recalibrate, please. Did you pass during the Civil War? Oh, well, that directly went to yes without any hesitation. If we made it available for you to communicate with us through an electronic device, would you like to do that? Oh, yes. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. I don't know, guys. Maybe we should get out the necrophonic. Jen's getting the necrophonic, so we'll see what we can pick up in this area. We've never visited this before. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and turn on the app. Whoa. Who was just, who was I just talking to a few minutes ago with the dousing rods? What's your name? Zach? Did you hear Zach? Did you say your name was Zach? Yeah. How old are you? Yeah. 
How old were you when you passed? Ten. Ten. Did you hear ten? Ah, oh, this one's whipping in my ear. I'm <laughs> freezing. I thought I heard ten, but I, I'm sure you're, you're probably have to a lot older than that. How old were you when you passed? Oh, that wind's whipping. Are you whipping that wind? <laughs> What happened to you? Shot. Did you hear that? Oh, yeah. Shot here. Ooh. Wow. That was intense. Did you did you die right away? No. Were you in the hospital for a while? Oh, there goes some geese. Mm -hmm. yes. I said thanks. You're welcome. I'm Jen and this is Lisa. Do you want to say hi to us? I heard a hi. Hi, I heard a hi. It's very cold out here all of a sudden. Are you guys making it really cold? Oh. Making the wind blow very fast? We know you're here. Please stop. It's very cold. Did you live? Did you live here? No. No. I heard a no and then I heard a yeah, so I don't know. Are we talking to a couple different people? I'm hearing three people. They said four. Do you guys want us to come back and visit you another day when it's maybe a little warmer? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we kind of want to come yeah, back on another chilly. day. It's so cold right now. I know it was a short conversation, but we thank you guys for talking to us. And we are protected, so you guys stay here, and we'll be back to visit you another day soon. <laughs> All right, thank you so much for talking to us. We appreciate it. Thank you, guys. All right. I think he said my pleasure. Oh. All right. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye bye. And that Necrophonic app, I don't know what it is about it. It's really spooky. And I know all you that have heard it before know what I'm saying. I mean, it just, it definitely sounds like voices from beyond. And the creepiest thing is that sometimes, oh, I must drop the phone. The creepiest thing is that it sometimes comes on by itself. Pretty frequently, actually. We've only started using it a couple times now. We've used it, what, two, three times? Yeah, three maybe times. three times. And every time that we have so far, it comes on by itself. So I don't know what's happening, but it's, it's definitely- like they turn it on. Yeah, it's like they're ready to talk to you. So we d I did say a prayer before we used it. And I didn't wear, <clears throat> I'm sorry, I heard something. Yeah. I didn't wear my, um, protection stone tape. Lisa has hers on. All right, guys. So that is a beautiful background. Beautiful and back here. The only thing that would make it even better is if it was like, I don't know, 20 degrees warmer. <laughs> now about 30. 30 would be good. It, the wind is really a factor right now. It literally feels like it could snow and it's March. Yeah, it's the wind chill. It's, oh. it, it's just like going right through us. So with that being said, guys, I think we're going to head out. And if you want us to come back to this place, let us know. Leave us a comment. Um, we were only here for a couple minutes, but we were getting some really great responses. Uh, but it's just too cold. So, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you on our next Raptor, Raptor Adventure. Adventure.